Hello everybody. Well, I'm here with Lyle, Parker, and Emily, and we are at the uh, Air Museum by March Air Force Base in Southern California. We're watching the planes take off and land over here, and we're exploring and uh, seeing all kinds of historic aircraft. This is a uh, Boeing B-47 Stratojet bomber. And while I was examining the engine on the other side, I noticed a, uh, a wasp making its way into the engine. And then we found over here, we found a bunch of uh, dead yellow jackets here. In the in in the intake here, you can see all these. These are called yellow jackets. We call them. I don't know exactly what they what they are. They're nowhere near as big as the uh, big guys in Japan. But they're oh, there's one right there. See, here's one going inside. That's very large, actually. That's quite large. That is a big hole. That's I. Wow. Quite large. Really. Okay, and we're going to see an F-16 take off. And I want to show you here, right here, there's a nest, a hornet nest. And you can see them fanning it. They're keeping it cool by a fan. You see the one hornet fanning the nest there? That's how they control the temperature. What an exciting thing for uh, me to uh, come out to uh, a place like this and discover hornets and wasps. And Lyle says an F, uh, F what is it about to take off? It's not an F-16 going that way. An F-16, and I see a big, I see a big plane coming in for a landing. At two o'clock, one, two. You there? No. You are. I, oh, I see it over there. Yes, yes, yes. And look at this big boy coming in right now for There's landing. Another one. There's two taking off. Let's let's take a look at this guy coming in for landing. There we go. See if I can zoom in. There it is. Now, what kind of plane is this, Lyle? That's coming in. I don't know. I think there's one over here, though. There's one over there. Isn't it like a B something a super cargo. cool? Big cargo plane. Now this is what Air Force Base is this? This is March. March Air Force Base. And what do they use this base for? This is an Air Force Base. That's an Air Force Base. And what do they use this base for? It is a reserve base for uh, cargo and refuelers. Now this plane's going to get really loud in a minute, isn't it? Yeah. Why is it going to get loud? He's going to turn his reverse jets on. Oh, no, he's just doing oh, touch, and touch, touch and go. So he touched on. This is training then, right? right. Isn't it? Turned left, doesn't he? Yep. Here comes some two F 16s, and I can tell, I think they're F 16s, they're a little bit off in the distance. They're about to take off. Outstanding. Which is a real treat because they take off like you're throwing a dart. Really? And I. Like, now you said that he tipped his wing at us? Yeah, he tipped his wings. Now that, that's the way, like saying, you, he saw you waving at him? Yeah, he's just saying hi. Did you hear that, Amy? The, the, the pilot saw us. And he tipped his wings to say hi to us. It's like making the whole airplane wave at us. Now you say a couple of jets, a couple of fighters are about to take off? Jets are about to take off. They're out down there at the end of the land. Uh, so let, let's just talk a little bit while we wait for the jets. This is, this is going to be for my Softy Papa channel. So it's really hornets, but we're really seeing other flying machines here as well. All kinds of fascinating airplanes, including uh, uh, helicopters, uh, trainer jets, a uh, drone aircraft. We, uh, they just moved in the, uh, uh, I'll turn it this way for a second, the uh, famous SR-71 uh, spy plane, the uh, Blackbird they call it. And when we came in, in, they told us that we could, I asked if we could use the camera. There's Parker, this is Lyle's son, Parker. He's saying, oh, he wants out. and he wants out, he wants to see the airplanes. And here's Emily. And they told us that we could take, you could use the camera, but they told us not to use a tripod. Why did they say that we couldn't use the tripod? Because the military comes zooming over here with their machine guns out, and because they have a problem with you uh, taking pictures of their military aircraft. And he says, he said, they'll actually, they're watching us probably. Yeah, they're keeping an eye on and, and you can see over there, there's a, there's a uh, uh, like a military, that's probably, um, Something right over there watching the airplanes. No, it's actually just people off the freeway that are hanging out. Watching. Oh, watching the airplanes. Yeah, you can stop there and have your lunch. And there, Lyle's house is right over there. You can see there's the big M. Yeah, just to the left of the big M at the bottom of the hill. Let's see if I can get that M in here, Lyle. We're in Moreno Valley, California. I don't know if I can get the M. Or where is it? These mountains over here. Ah, uh, sorry everybody, I can't quite zoom in. Okay, it's over that and to the left. Over here, I can't go, it's very, very bright. Over there, there's an M on a mountain. Marino, Lyle lives right over there. And the gals, Yuniko and uh, Jen, Lyle's wife, are out um, 
at a, uh, a full body, full massage today. Yep. All day full massage. Full body massage. Full All body day. massage. You love those. They just went over. Yeah. Well, as long as they. Never mind. I won't say it. But <laughs> this is a G-rated channel. Actually, Jen just. No bad words on this channel. Jen just texted me. They're heading over to the mud pit, which is you take mud in your mouth. Mud pit. Yep. Mud pit. It's a big mud pit. Mud pit. It's full of red mud. That sounds like fun. I'd like to throw the mud around and do that. I know. And meanwhile, we're here. What are you doing, Emmy? Then you go. Wait. How do you? What do you think of all these airplanes? Hot. 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 <laughs> it Let's is. Get inside. Very hot. I think after this, we'll have to get some. Uh, we'll get some lunch after a while, and then, um, and then maybe something cool to drink. I'm going for another smoothie later. But look, look at this plane right here. This has got a, a, a machine gun. Why does uh, why would a plane like this, the Stratofortress, have a machine gun? It, it, wouldn't there be everything that it would do would be over the horizon? Oh yeah. Wouldn't it have like uh, fighter jets uh, escorting it? And but it's pre World War II, so back then you still had uh, some propeller-driven airplane coming out and trying to harass you. So it had it had the machine gun anyway. Yeah. I'm just gonna. Go over here and peek up this, and we're going to wait for these jets to take off. If if they take if they take off. Meanwhile, I'm just going to talk. We can keep walking, guys. Now there is. Hey Lyle, there's no way to peek out of this. There isn't. There isn't. It must be a cam camera. I don't know what that is. So there must be a camera right there. But look at these guns. Man, what do you think this is? 50 caliber, maybe? Maybe it shoots wasps. <laughs> pow, 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 pow. But this has a bicycle, uh, bicycle style um, wheel. Now we'll just keep the camera running for a little bit. This started off as a wasp video, but we'll talk about more. Let's as we continue our walk. Oh, now we're looking at some. Now this. You think this is open, or these things are just fell down? Uh, I don't know. Now these. That looks like a like a. That's a post World War II maybe. Navy, maybe that's a trainer. I don't know. I don't know anything. Look at all these jets. Now Lyle and I are big uh, military uh, hardware enthusiasts. We sit at home uh, when we were living here. And are we supposed to be in here? We got roped off yeah, here. No plane. Okay, and we would sit there and watch what you know the uh, what do we call the General Fargenrager channel, yep. the military channel, and we love to watch all this stuff. That's that is Air Force uh, jet. I love New York Police Department. I don't know. It looks like some sort of a special bomb there. Oh, Ma, get the heck out of the way. You're, the <laughs> You're maroon. <laughs> You're the maroon. <laughs> it's great to spend the day with my kid and my uh, brother and, and uh, my nephew. Now, we have, wow, now look at the size of this thing. Let's just go over and look at this bad boy. That looks like it has a whole uh, you know, observatory up there. Lau, well, do you have any idea what this is? I look, there's a family over there sitting under the wing. This is big, U.S. Air Force. Let's get the uh, stats on this bat boy. This aircraft is proudly maintained by uh, Doug Berger, its crew member, Red Hat volunteer. This is a Boeing KC-97L. It's an aerial refueling tanker. It was also used as a commercial airliner. The propeller is used as a flying boom. So it's a re refueling aircraft plus a airliner. You about to take off? Oh yeah, it's a prop plane. I wonder what that thing is on the top. Are those jets going to take off? You got one. Circling. One should be coming in here pretty soon. Really? What kind of jet is that? Uh, I think it's a C uh, C147. Oh, is it? They call it. Is it a propeller or a jet? It's a jet. It is a jet. Okay. Wow, how exciting. One they just one they just took off one. Really? Yeah. Yeah, Usually they make they make touch and goes here all the time. How neat! Ah. Nice front row seat in the shade. It's not too black. Small jets go down that way. I wonder if I go up here if I can get a better view. Without falling down. Okay, now I can see it with the Air Force Base. Now, hopefully the uh, the guys or the MPs won't mind if I film. Look at those airplanes over there. 
Here's the uh, control tower. More. Well, let's continue our tour. Have a nice day, guys. Okay. Oh, this is, yeah, it is another refueling plane. Look at that. The boom. The boom there. It's turning into a long video, but what the heck? Well, there's a nice Coast Guard plane over there. Our father was in the Coast Guard. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. He was what did he do? Navigator or something like that? Mm, he did something. Yeah, he did something. He was seen him in his uh, Coast Guard duds. Quite nice. Lockheed Lodestar. Emily, you're doing really good out here. You got your fan? You, do, you know, you're going to deserve yourself an ice cream or something like that. Okay. Now, I know this is hot. Yeah. We're going to, we have a store for Emily. We're going to take her to the uh, um, mall. The mall and the little girl's uh, clothing store. She's going to load up on stuff. But Oh, you got these yesterday. Yeah, she got this, this shirt, this, this skirt, and this necklace, right? It says, the big, hold on, stop for a second. A nice E. E for extra cute. No? <laughs> Emily. Look at these. Oh, look at the way the uh, Coast Guard uh, planes, that's a seaplane. Yeah. So it can land in the water or on ground. Over here. More jets. Well, everybody, I think. Uh, I think we're out of luck for seeing the jets take off, but that's okay. Right. Yeah, we've seen uh, lots of other things as well, and uh, it's a great to have a, an actual a chance to uh, show a little adventuring with a fan in my face. <laughs> <laughs> From uh, beautiful Moreno Valley. Are we still in Moreno Valley? Yes, we are. Moreno, beautiful Moreno Valley, Southern California, USA. Excellent place to stay and visit and spend with my little brother, who's much, much, actually much bigger than me, and he now has a fan in front of his face, too. Yes. Emily's a fan of mine. Yes, right. Let's say goodbye to Parker. Goodbye, Parker. You having fun, buddy? Parker, 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 Allen Bell. Yeah, happy boy. I'll take your footsies. Okay, and there's my sweetie Emily. Emily, can you uh, say Can you push the button as you look at Emily? Uncle Al, Uncle Al, give us a give us a serious give us your funniest face. There you go. Bye bye. Bye.